Hello, hello and welcome to today's running of the AAA Autism Speaks 400. Today, 36 of NASCAR's best lineup around this one mile con concrete oval. See, he'll come out on top at the end of 10 laps in the Monster Mile. Let's take a look at our drivers to watch for. Martin Truex Jr. starts on the pole. It's a very fast number 78. Bernard Toro, Toyota Camry. Can he get it done? How about Kyle Busch? He won the last time we were here at Dover in the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series. Can he get it done here today? Daniel Suarez starts fifth. A great qualifying run for the rookie. Can he get it done? Today, for us at the starting spot. Dale Jr.'s last ever start at Dover. What can he do in that 88 Nationwide Insurance throwback? How about Eric Jones? Switches to the 77 the first time. That Ferrari will be fielding two cars this season. And Jimmy Johnson, the King of Dover, you can never count him out. Now it's time for your command. Drivers, start your engines. The cars going to roll off for 10 laps. Let's take a look at our starting lineup. In row one today, we have... Martin Truex Jr. and Kyle Busch. In row two, we have Kyle Larson and Matt Kenseth. In row three, we have Daniel Suarez and Denny Hamlin. In row four, we have Dale Jr. and Ryan Newman. In row five, Kevin Harvick and Eric Jones. And in row six, we have Ryan Blaney and Chase Elliott. Sorry for the voice crack. Sep in row seven is uh, Kurt Busch and Eric Almirola. In row eight is Ricky Senos Jr. and Brad Keselowski. Joey Legat. Jimmy Johnson, Joey Logano, Rick at row 9, and run, rounding out run row 10 is Clint Boyer and Trevor Main. Row 11 is Michael Gaston and Tre Case Kane. Then we have uh, Austin Dillon and Danica Patrick in row 12. Row 13 is, um, sorry, all right, just take a look at the starting lineup. As today, we have so Ty Dillon making his debut in today, today as well, as well as Corey LaJoy in the 83, and Greg Golding in the 23. Now it's time to go racing here in Dover. Green flag is in the air. We're racing in Dover. Truex leads him to it. Great jump by Truex. He's going to lead lap one over Larson. Truex. Oh, big wreck on lap two. 18 car pile up. Oh, my God. Red flags out as they cannot get through. In front stretch, Elliott Sadler is involved. Tough break for him. He's falling back in points. So is Dan Kilpatrick. Um... Alex Bowman, Greg Alding, tough debut. Same thing with Corey LaJoy, uh, Landon Castle, couldn't move up in points. Um, Paul Menard, Justin Allgaier, H. God is not done well. A.J. Allmendinger, uh, Chandler, you hate to see Rex this early. There's David Reagan, I mean, 18 cars sticking out in lap two, Casey Kane. Um, I mean, that's just crazy. Austin Dillon. Ty Dillon is better than his brother in his first start. How about that? Congrats. Props to him. There's Je me, Michael Gaston, um, Jeremy McMurray, Joey Logano, and Clint Boyer. That's half the field, basically. So, cars roll off again after a red flag that just took out half the field. So getting ready to go back. Green flag racing. Green flag's out. Great restart by Kyle Larson. Larson's going to go to the lead. What a restart by Kyle Larson. He capitalizes on a bad restart by Truex, and Junior's going to take second. Down the back stretch, into three, and a big wreck. Johnson, hard hit. Eric Jones and Brad Keselowski involved as well. Red flags out again. Jimmy Johnson. There is Eric Jones and Brad Keselowski. I'll go on behind the wall. The car's going to roll off once again as we get ready for our Overtime attempt. As green flag is back in the air. Great restart by Ricky Sandhouse Jr. He's up to third. They're going to be side by side for a second. White flag is out. Larson gets jumped. Three by three. Three by three wide at the line. And I have no clue who won. It, the slow motion replay. I can't tell. It's either Stenhouse or Chase from that angle. I do don't know. I think it's Chase. I think it's Chase. Well, the three drivers are waiting for the word by NASCAR to be given to see who's the winner. Stenhouse, that'd be great because it, it, now he's only four points outside. If he finishes second, he'd be four, four points first, three points outside the wild card spot. 
this would be big for him because he would make the chase and just get war through my headset. We have a winner. Chase Elliott, second win of the season. Rick Sanders Jr. will get second and third as Kyle Larson as Chase burns it down. Congratulations, bud. You deserved it. Now let's go take a look at our finishing results. In finishing first is Chase Elliott. In second is Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Great run for him. Third is Kyle Larson. Great run for that 42 team. Dale Jr. finishes fourth. Fifth today is Matt Kenseth. And sixth is Kevin Harvick. Seventh today was Kurt Busch. Great run for him. And then eighth was Martin Truex Jr. Pole sitter. Ninth was Eric Almirola. Great run for that 43 team. And tenth was Kyle Busch. Eleventh was Daniel Suarez. Not bad run for him. Could have done better. And then twelfth was Ryan Newman. A great run for that 31 team. Thirteenth was Denny Hamlin. And fourteenth was Trevor Bain. Roush had a good run today. And Blaney gets fifth. 15th, not bad. And there's Kozlowski in 16th. And 17th today was Eric Jones. 18th was Jimmy Johnson. 19th today was Clint Boyer. And rounding out your top 20 is Joey Logano. Finishing 21st was Jamie McMurray. And 22nd was Michael Gaston. 23rd today was Ty Dillon. And 24th was Austin Dillon. 25th today was Casey Kane. And 26th was David Reagan. Good run for that 38 team. Best finish of the season, I think. And then we have uh, Chandler Petty. And then 28th is A.J. Omendinger. 29th is Justin Allgaier. And 30th is Paul Menard. 31st today was Landon Castle. And 32nd was Corey LaJoy. 33rd today was Greg Galding. And 34th was Alex Bowman. A tough break for this kid. He's looking forward to taking over that 88. And 35th was at Danica Patrick. And rounding out the field is Elliot Sadler. Thank you all for watching and tune in for Talladega, the last race before the chase.